Hello and welcome back. It is more Dog Boy Minecraft. Well, we know and love, but we all come here together to enjoy. It's me doing a bunch of random stuff in Clayton, our favorite town. Thank you for joining me. Let's get started on this journey together. Ah, Clayton. A one pumpkin town. Soon to be a many pumpkin town. To match the many cats we have. We have many cats in Clayton. In fact, we may even have up to six of them. Aww. To me, that's a lot of cats. Are these stocks fully grown? They might be. They are. Hmm. Looks like it's not very efficient to harvest them. Also, I'm really not sure why I'm whispering. I think I'm just a little bit tired today. Like a low-key sort of vibe. Hello, Mr. Man. You've got a lot of experience. Huh? Well, that's because he's a mason. We've definitely traded with him before. Huh? Very nice. That's right. We're switching our snacks over to dried kelp. I remember not being sure what to do with the the sort of like festival stand situation I kind of wanted to conjure. Huh? I want to expand like lines of stalls all the way down there. Maybe I should work on that today. I know the pool house still needs a little bit of work. A lot of places here that still need a little bit of work. But you know what? That's what we're here for. We're here to improve the town. Make it a place that's better for us. Better for the villagers. Maybe better for the golems. <laughs> and eventually incorporate Belton over there. Hey, there's your viewer. Welcome. Welcome to the channel. This is just a chill Minecraft stream. Where nothing important happens. Just slowly building up a town. Mystic Mayhem. Shalom to you too. Thank you for joining. I hope you're having a good day. It's good timing because I was about to use the toaster. Now the toaster's fun to watch. Gathering volunteers. It's sort of going bad. But how are you? That's totally understandable. Not every day can be a good one. I'm just kind of tired, otherwise totally fine. I'm in a pretty good mood, actually. And I hope that some of my good mood can rub off on you. Like when I do this.
This is the toaster. It's my main source of iron. <laughs> oh, see, that's the best part. No buildings ever have to burn. Just the golems. It's totally safe. It's beautiful, isn't it? Golems don't mind. They don't feel pain. They're a hive mind built from the spirit of defense that the villagers conjure up. And here's our loot. Very nice. No items lost. All the leads come back. It's perfect. And now we get to plant more flowers. We'll feed some of these to the bees. Hello, bee. A arson, B barson, C commit arson, D don't come near me. I'm going to commit arson. Now that is the alphabet that everybody should learn. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> What the baby? That one's an adult. What about you? What about you? What about you? What about you? Make babies. I've only got two babies so far. Any other parents want to come browse with us? Do parental activities. Oh, here's some more. You and you. Now we got three babies. Can we be friends? We can be friends in the same way that everybody else who followed me is my friend. Which is to say that they get a lot of my attention because I have very few followers. <laughs> but yeah, totally. I mean, I already care about your well-being because you're, you're a person. I care about all people's well-being. <laughs> your first friend? I'm sure that's not true. I'm sure you have plenty of friends. But I appreciate that you appreciate it. And speaking of appreciation, thank you very much for the follow. You didn't have to, but you did. And you made my life better in doing so. That's beautiful. I hope that I can give you a better day. Maybe even in some small way, a better life. I shall give you a shout out on my channel. Aww, that's so nice. In that case, I'll say to my viewers, anybody who wants to, please go check out Mystic Mayhem. I don't know what kind of content you do, but if you enjoy arson, it's probably good. I'm out here picking carrots and everybody else went to bed. <laughs> oh, that's right. My bed's in my inventory. If all my subscribers follow you, you'll get 1.60k followers. Are you serious? I don't even have 50 yet. <laughs> that's nuts. Congratulations on getting that far. That's really cool. Must have taken a lot of work. I'm a bit of a lazy person myself, so that really strikes me as impressive. The key is anime. <laughs> that is, uh, that's good. That's a good strategy. 
mine was taking a bunch of Roblox requests, but it turned out that people like me watching liked watching me play Minecraft more anyway. Well, so far, only one person has voted in my poll of what they would like to see me playing. I can only sort of guess. <laughs> it's like, you can ask people for feedback, but you can't make them give you feedback. Do you want to play Minecraft together? Sure. I've regretted saying yes to things like this before. <laughs> but you have so much more experience than me. I'm sure you know the game by now. And by the game, I don't mean Minecraft. I have a survival multiplayer you can join. Yeah, I might pop on just for today and give it a whirl, do something a little different for a change. The town can certainly wait. Nothing bad ever happens in Clayton. That's for certain. <laughs> I've been playing for, I think, six years of Minecraft experience. Very nice, very nice. I'm about the same. Started when it just came out. And those are the days. Actually, I like this version of Minecraft much better. The original version was very clearly lacking. And now we have all this cool stuff. Like bees. I love the bees. Alright, well. I'll hop on it, why not? Oh yeah, and um, feel free to... Follow the link to my Discord if you want. That's an easy way to send me stuff and get in contact with me. I've even got a little section for collaboration. <laughs> oh, you did? Oh, you are good at this. I just started about a month or two ago. In the requests section. Oh. Well, in that case, you've been doing it about double as long as I have. That's pretty good. Let's see. There you are. Vulan Gate. I'll go and check it out. Bye for now, Clayton. Look the iron ingot. Oh, I proved I was not a robot. As far as you know. Hi, Mystic. I like your outfit. Looks great. Hey, Axolotl. How's my favorite transgender 30-year-old furry doing? Pretty good, actually. I just got invited to collaborate with Mystic Mayhem. <laughs> Whoa. Something just fell over in my apartment. It's fine. Did you go through the purple? My head was turned for a minute. I'm just going to assume so. <laughs> nice. Well, i got to do something real quick, so I'll be back. Cool. Actually, I'm going to take a minute to go pick up the thing that fell over, and I'll be right back.
back. Grab the mic. There we go. Mystic, if you tried to voice call me, I usually don't like to voice call with people on stream before I've had a chat with them off stream first. Just so I can make sure that I have the right vibe for the channel. I hope you don't mind that I'm not uh, answering it. Not this time anyway. My stream has lag. I've been told this. It's probably because I have 5,000 browser tabs open or something. I wouldn't be surprised. Mm hmm Yeah, there's definitely a delay. Sure. <laughs> Hello. Hmm. <laughs> I really like your server. I like how well built everything is. And this, like, flower thing is beautiful. Oh, I see. Okay. Here we go. All right. And if you don't mind, if you're typing to me, can it be through either Minecraft or my chat? Because if it's through Discord, then the viewers won't know what we're talking about. Aw, thank you for the diamonds. Super appreciate the boost. Oh, permissions on that. Is that a build over there? Cool. I have trusted you. You can have the armor. Nice, 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 nice. So I'm assuming you mean these two pieces. Yeah, that's what I can see in there. Thank you very much. I enjoy not dying. Uh, I can help you with a build. I might as well help you with a build, because I'm probably not going to stay on the server very long. I'm just mostly here to, like, uh, check it out and to chat. This is another streamer's home. Oh, cool. Thank you.
Oh yeah, and I have a habit of not paying attention. <laughs> If you go down the elevator, there's my nether portal. Cool. Did you want to go in the nether? Oh, sure. Let's go. Not build in this world. This world we set some fish line. I instantly leveled in acrobatics. <laughs> Oh, I see. He showed me which way to go, because I'm a little slow. I never got good at stuff like parkour in Minecraft. I know how to get around, but I'm not super great at it. Oh, no. Well. I guess I'll wait for you. Excuse me. Are you trying to tell me something? I'm back, and I have two good news, says our good friend. Feel free. What's up?
what do you want to do? I don't know. You led me all the way into the nether. <laughs> I'm not really sure what the plan was. I can't hear you. Is my mic off? Uh, my mic is on now. Thank you for letting me know. <laughs> oh, oh, dang it. I was saying uh, I'm, I'm happy that things went well and I'd like to hear about them. Doodle World got an update. Ooh, is it more plot? Uh -huh. And my crush gave me her number? Aww, uh -huh. that's so great. I'm really happy for you. It must be a really good day for you. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, Mystic Mayhem says nice. That's really cool. More plot and the first key. Oh, was the first key not available for getting until now? Interesting. Aw, the sign says you're cute. That's so sweet. So, Mystic, I was thinking either I can help you with a build that you're doing, or just, like, you can just show me around and show stuff off. I think that would be fun, because I'm probably not going to stay here very long. Maybe just, like, you know, this episode, or if we're really into it, maybe a couple more. Although, who knows? I know that collaboration is good for the channel, and it's so tiny right now. I might as well. Okay, TP to me. Do, 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 do. Axolotl, that's so cool. I'm really happy for you. Oh, sorry, I just trimmed your grass a little bit. <laughs> Every time I see double grass, I just punch the top part. You're lucky my crush rejected me a bit ago, lol. Aw, I'm sorry to hear that, ma'am. Or do you prefer Mystic? That's a shame. You know, it's bound to happen once in a while. But it's still sad. I'm working on this to surprise the streamer. Oh, that's so nice. So if I can copy your design, then I'll be helping. Let me know where to put stuff, and I will put it in the spot that you tell me to put it. Because I'm not sure what part you're doing next. Well, I guess since we're sharing crush stories, I recently had a date with one of my crushes, and it went pretty well. I'm pretty happy about it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
If you can make stone bricks, then turn them into slabs and then place them as the floors. Sure. Do you want it uh, right above the grass or replacing the height that the grass is at? Also, where should I quarry? I don't want to start ripping up any areas that you like to keep nice. At the dark oak layer. Oh, uh, I see. So half slabs that are at the top edge of the uh, dark oak going all the way around. Sounds good to me. Um, Stone bricks specifically. Got it. Yeah, show me where to quarry. Or unless you have enough stone already. Okay, cool. I'll work on that then. Probably gonna want to cook a little bit more of them. Do you want bricks specifically? Okay, we want probably want a stone cutter tool. If not enough, then just go into my mine. Is the mine the one down this elevator you have here? Perfect. I will do that then. This is fun. I don't often do projects for other people, but I enjoy it. Okay, I'm gonna steal an iron ingot to make a stone cutter. Thanks for that pick. If it was intended for me and I didn't just scoop it. Unbreaking pickaxe. Very nice. I'm gonna put that there. If that's a terrible place, feel free to move it. All right. So stone brick slab. You're talking about these, right? Perfect. All right. I promise not to go crazy taking resources. Oh, you don't care? That's perfect then, I guess. I'm gonna cook some. Get this out of there. Put it back here, I guess. Start some. Four. I don't have a lot of iron, so I'm not going to make any hoppers or anything. Ooh, what did I get? Uh, wasn't paying attention, but thank you. Oh, it's probably the bow. Nice, I love bows. Oh, iron? Oh, there it is. Okay, in that case, I'm going to set up uh, a little auto furnace thing. Maybe I won't have to. This might be good enough. And I'm going to use this top chest up here as just a random putting stuff back. 
that I'm not needing at the moment. At least not this exact moment. Oh, and I'll make myself some diamond pants. Can't go wrong with diamond pants. It's like my legs are encased in crystal. Perfect. <laughs> Oh, and I'm so happy. I just remembered that in um, in my super flat town, I was digging in my quarry, and I just happened to run across an amethyst geode. It's just so lovely. I love the amethyst in this game. I'm going to make a whole building out of it, or at least use it for a lot of the floors and stuff. Oh, I could make the streets out of Amethyst. That'd be some Wizard of Oz level stuff. That'd be great. Well, 22 is enough to start. Using half slabs for the floor is a pretty good idea. It's cheaper to produce, plus it gives more headspace. I like that. <laughs> I like your enthusiasm for fire. It's very fun. How much of a discount is this? It's one for two. I think that's no discount. It's equal to normal. But it is faster, so that's nice. This used to be how I would play Minecraft every time, as I would just go on a random multiplayer server and uh, just sort of be like, hey, where can I fit in? I'll just do whatever. I find that stuff really relaxing. Of course, I have my own big ideas, but time and a place for everything, I think. It's good to go back and forth on doing stuff I want, doing stuff other people want. <laughs> Me? You're not talking to me, are you? Mystic Mayhem said you are a very smart and amazing person. <laughs> oh, you are? <laughs> you said I am, and that seems like it could have either been an answer to my question about who you were talking to, or it could be that you were saying that you, yourself, are an amazing person. I, I accept both. It is about you. Okay, well, now it's about you as well. It's about both of us now. <laughs> That's so sweet. Seriously, I'm not even sure what prompted you to say that, but I'm very flattered that I have that effect on you. It's so nice being with people who are just like, hey, you're cool. Hey, you're cute. 
I'm I'm just like constantly blushing at this point. Just like people are being so nice to me. I think the cute avatar definitely helps. <laughs> Uh, now I have to double check to make sure it's on. Yep, it's on. Okay, cool. I'm really proud of the design I came up with. And I want to do more 3D modeling and stuff. Mm -hmm. This one was a VWide Studio model. But I want to see if I can get into Blender and do more stuff with it. <laughs> I love that I can just like fall like carelessly and like get points and acrobatics. In real life, I think that would just give you a knee injury. <laughs> oh look how good at being hurt in the legs I am. Well if I get points for it, that's that's fine with me for sure. Let's see. Uh sticks. And I'm going to steal some of the charcoal, make a few more torches. What? That doesn't work? Oh, it does. Oh. I'm playing with a broken arm. <laughs> and you deserve it. Aww. Hey. I'm not sure if that'll help your arm heal faster. Probably won't. But at the same time, I kind of admire the panache. You got to have a... A good set of, uh, oh, well, good set of, um, something on you. To just be like, pain, eh. I have a picture of myself in the hospital with a cast on, and, and with the arm that the cast is on, I'm giving a thumbs up to the camera. <laughs> it's great. I really like that photo of me. I've been hurt way too many times for a normal human. Yep. And it all come back to bite you. The older you get, the more those old injuries are just like, hey, remember me? So I definitely wish you good luck. And I hope things heal properly. I have like small wrists and ankles and at this point they're just permanently injured from all the times I've like tripped over them. You're 13? Oh, well kids getting hurt frequently is actually pretty normal as long as it's not, you know, the kind of stuff that's like really serious. Getting minor injuries is actually something that should happen pretty frequently. The body is designed to be healing itself a lot. They say that, um, that, um, there's this thing that's kind of gross, so pardon me, but because, like, you know, most men don't have monthly cycles, that they end up having higher blood pressure because they're not losing it through that process. And so it's actually healthier for men to occasionally get like cuts and scrapes that make them bleed because it lowers their blood pressure and helps cycle their blood. It's so weird to think about, but I read that from like a normal science journal, just a normal medical journal. <laughs> it's just like, okay, sure. So getting getting a little bit beat up occasionally is actually pretty healthy for you. It's always when things are a little too much to handle that it becomes a problem. I hope you only get roughed up as much as you can handle. <laughs> or less than that. I was in the hospital for a while. They only they almost put me on hospice three times. Whoa. I don't know what it means to put a 13-year-old on hospice, but I'm glad it didn't happen, I guess. Does that mean like transferring you to a permanent care facility? 
that means they have a limited time to live. Oh, dang. I'm glad you made it for sure. That's, that's like quite a, that's quite a life event to go through. I remember my friend telling me that, um, his dad had like a rare condition and that nobody really knew how to treat it and they gave him a couple months and the guy lived for like six years after that i mean it's a good thing and a bad thing but sometimes the doctors give you a number but they actually have no clue human beings are weird we survive a lot of things that seem like we shouldn't be able to. And then on the other side, we can also die from things pretty suddenly and confusingly. So it's kind of like a mixed bag. I mean, like... I don't know if I've ever told this story before, but when I was born, I wasn't breathing. <laughs> I was completely blue. I was actually gonna die. In fact, the nurse told my mom I was dead already. You too? Dang. And it's just like, what's more true? Was it that the nurse was wrong? Or that I was weird? <laughs> it's like, it's hard to know for sure. All right, what are we doing at the calcite? Oh, I see. We're doing a wall one block in. All right, how many high? Uh, let's see, Axo says, you were also not breathing during birth. Pretty high, okay, cool. Axo, did that happen to you too? Or are you talking about how me and Mystic both had that? It can be really rough on mothers when like babies have like weird birth complications. But people with weird birth complications Make surprisingly recoveries all the time. Yeah, I was actually like... I wasn't just not breathing. I hadn't been breathing for a while. <laughs> I was like, technically dead. But I came back. Having a me too? Dang. Do you know what caused it? Because for me, it was being mummified in the umbilical cord. I was like... <laughs> it was like, you know, head to toe wrapped. Because I was thrashing around or something. Do you want me to continue the wall on this these parts? Oh, no, wait. That's the wrong part. I'll let you do this part because I'm not sure where to go from here. Is a door. <laughs> okay, cool. So, is that right? Okay, cool. <laughs> Did you want some of the calcite back? Did you run out? Ooh, a nice entryway. Axo says, like the medication they give my mom to ease the pain was stopping my stopping her heart, my heart, and my lungs. 
So I think those are called epidurals. Yeah, I hear that they can probably cause more problems than they're worth. For anybody who's thinking about going on epidurals because the pain is so much, like, there's other ways to make the pain way less, like water births, for instance. Water births take a lot of the pain off of your, like, spine and everything. And there's also, um, most of the time, before we invented the sort of modern way to do it, which isn't very good, um, people used to give birth in slings or chairs where their body was supported but upright. And it helps a lot. Ooh, these are the stairs. The, the way we have people give birth by laying on their backs is actually really stressful for them, and it's not the best way to do it. A lot of people don't know that. Story time? <laughs> I mean, basically, yeah. We like to sort of, like, swap, like, uh, sometimes nonsense, sometimes, like, personal opinions, sometimes, like, stories. Yeah, just kind of off and on the whole time. Okay, I have a story how I died and came back. Ooh, you too, huh? Let's, let's hear it. I love these kinds. <laughs> oh, I'm going to get more torches. Oh, wait, you took the staircase. Oh, wait, this is the new staircase. Okay, I gotcha. I'm going to bring more blocks in. More torches. Oh, here's some. Mystic Mayhem says, okay, so when I was six, I accidentally rode my bike uh, off a ledge, and then I went into a coma for two months, and then I flatlined for six hours, and then I got out of my coma, and I have a mental disorder still. Yeah, that's the thing that sucks about brains that stop um, receiving oxygen, is that you have parts of it just start permanently... Um, like, what's the word? It's like the neurons themselves individually start dying. And so you can have like a randomized effect. Well, I'm really glad you survived. Comas are really weird. Comas are one of the weirdest things that exist in like medicine. For sure. Also, our understanding of what is and isn't death is always evolving. Yay, arson! <laughs> Yay! Now I'm hot. <laughs> now you're hot. <laughs> it's perfect. Yay! We died of fire. Oh, I survived. Aw. That's okay. Maybe I'll die next time. Oh, good. Thank you. I finally got to burn to death. That's so beautiful. I know for sure that if I got video game powers in real life that I could respawn and stuff, I would definitely just test all the different ways to die. And then I could give people information about it. Like, what's the worst one? What's one that's more okay? I would totally do that. Don't bring up Squirty Cream for three streams in a row. That's enough about Squirty Cream. I'm done with it. You survived the arson of 2022. Never mind, Joe. Interesting. 
<laughs> Mystic Mayhem. Out of the seven times I tried to unalive myself, drowning was the worst one. Oh boy, yeah. I've heard drowning sucks a lot. I've heard that it's absolutely terrible. I'm not going to talk about what I heard was the best one. I think that's inappropriate to do on my stream, at least. But um, I had one figured out, but I survived. I was lucky that my fear of death was stronger than my stress. I want that skelly. Give me a skelly. I uh, hit it drop. Oh well. Oh, oh I say squirty cream in every stream. Alright, well, I'm gonna stop responding to it eventually. You can say it, and that'll be your thing. <laughs> To be clear, for anyone listening, Axolotl is talking about canned whipped cream. That's it. It's just whipped cream. Whipped cream in an aerosol can. That's why it's funny. It's because it sounds naughty, but it's just a food item. Why did they name it that? Why do they call it that? Why do they think that that's normal? We don't know. Watch out, there's a creep. Oh. Oh. Creeper griefing us off. That's good. Ugh. Axo says, I'm Axo, also known as Squirty Cream Guy. <laughs> I mean, if you want, if you want to be known that way. I will not stop you. Because we all gotta follow our bliss, you know what I mean? We all gotta do what makes us happy. Including being super weird. I'm definitely weird. Alright, what's next on the house? It's looking great so far. Just put some lights down to get less spawns. I'm gonna go commit arson. Cool. Have a good one. I might dig in the mine a little bit. Just because. Axo says, or I'm known as the cutest Roblox avatar in the stream. It's true, especially compared to my Roblox avatar, which is a pretty cursed. <laughs> Oops. Oh, he has more health than I have arrows. It's okay. We can juke him. Woo! Yes. Yeah, your axolotl avatar is just a delight. Every time I see it, I'm just transfixed. Sir, I drop kicked that child in self defense. <laughs> Corporate needs you to find the difference between these two pictures. Drop. 
transfixed. I thought you were transgender. You did it. You made the joke. <laughs> brow, 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 brow. <laughs> you caught the setup. <laughs> you caught the setup and you slam dunked it. You did it. <laughs> I'm like, am I gonna make? Uh, I'm, am I gonna make the punchline? Nah, I'll just leave it. And then you did it. You got the punchline. <laughs> Let's see. What was Mayhem saying? I kind of got drowned in text. Mayhem says, you're trans? That's cool. Yeah, totally. I'm a trans guy. He, him pronouns. And that's, yeah, that's the important parts. I always catch the setup. Yeah, you're great, Axo. Oh yeah, <laughs> me being trans. This is this is not true for everybody, of course. But me being trans is why my voice is so high pitched. <laughs> You're pan and non-binary. Heck yeah, I'm non-binary too. I just call myself a trans guy because it's simpler. <laughs> That's really sweet. Trans forever. Trans gang. Yeehaw. <laughs> oh, I should grab food. I started to make trans flags on my like on my build at home because I wasn't and then I realized there's no reason for me to not do that so I decided to just start making trans flags everywhere. I'm gender fluid but I have no actual gender at the moment. That's cool. I'm gender fluid too. <laughs> I like um on the masculine side. So I usually don't bother saying anything. It's like I go through like agender, demi boy, normal man, and like other stuff like gender queer. <laughs> you are now my brother slash sister thingy. I'll take brother. Thank you so much. I really appreciate the vibes. It's nice that we can actually talk about being trans. It's good. Things are going in a nice direction. Axo says he's a transgender, 30-year-old, low-class, furry, puppet, wolf, funny, dinosaur, stream YouTuber. I think some of those words you could change, but for the most part, that is true. <laughs> Listen, I may be in poverty, but I'm not low-class. <laughs> I've got class. I just don't have money. <laughs> Mystic Mayhem says, yeah, same. <laughs> oh, I turned on sticky keys. Gee whiz. <laughs> oh, yes. You remembered I was a puppet. I only said that like once, maybe twice. That's really cool. I mean, I'm not a puppet. The, the V-Road Studio avatar I'm using right now doesn't have any hands or legs or anything. It's just a hoodie and a head. <laughs> Oh yeah, is the floor done? Okay. You or me finish the floor. So now the floor's done. Good, good, good. What's next on this really good designed house? I actually really like this design that you're working with. It's very cool. Is it going to have windows? Oh, if I keep jumping off of it, I'll just keep leveling up in acrobatics. That's nice. Whee! I get a whole level every time. Pretty impressive. Whee! Oh, I rolled. Ooh. Uh, I didn't want to say poor. That's okay. I mean, I am poor. <laughs> That's just a fact. <laughs> I'm poor in money. And also pour in energy. But I make it work. <laughs> yes, so much acrobatics. And the vocal cords of an angel. Aww. Thank you. That's so sweet. What the heck? Mystic Mayhem says, bro. <laughs> I 
I do have like Mystic if you're interested. I do have like um a video where I'm doing ukulele and singing and I'm like that stuff is fun. I like doing that stuff. Mm hmm. Hi. Chat. Uh what's up? A great dad and advice giver. That's very nice of you to say. I really appreciate it. Check out Minecraft chat. Okay, I missed something then. Uh, he said, hmm. uh, bro. Oh, 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 I'm level 267 in mining. Nice. That's rad. Dang. <laughs> I mean, that makes sense. I don't like to quarry, but you must do. Because, like, I can't even imagine. I mean, I like spelunking, but I hate quarrying. Yeah. <laughs> Yay, levels. <laughs> Can I make you a skin? Sure. I mean, if you want to. Actually, I said that in kind of like an iffy way. I was just surprised. I'm going to say, yeah, absolutely. I'd be thrilled. I'd be flattered. I love it when people make me stuff because it's good for two reasons. It's good because it flatters me. And it's also good because I get to see people showing off their awesome skills. And like, that's great. I love that. Axo says, that reminds me, I need to, oh, that reminds, oh, I see, that reminds me I need to make a Minecraft skin. Yeah, if you can make one as cute as your Roblox one, then you'd have nothing to worry about after that. <sighs> Away from keyboard real quick. I, I know AFK, but RQ, I'm just like, RQ, no problem. It's so weird that, like, Gen Zers are still using, like, chat slang that my dad's generation invented. Like, that's so wild. Like, my dad grew up on, like, you know, video games and, like, when you could program a computer using a telephone. It was so weird. And they had their own set of, like, internet slang and stuff, and now we're still using it. It's crazy. <laughs> and I like that we're still kind of in the wild west of computers. It's like you're never quite sure what the next thing somebody's going to do is going to be. I love that. Maybe I should try to join the fishing contest. Mm. No, no strain. Check the message to see if it's somebody. Oh, you did it. Oh, it's so cute. That's really cute. Thank you. 
if you want to, you can post it in my Discord's um, sharing channel if you want to. And also, I have like a I have like a pause screen. It's not working right now, but I have a pause screen where I rotate fan art through it. If you want to, I can uh, show this on there with your name or link, whatever you like. I like to do that. I'm I I've, I've been working on an automatic rotation software for showing the different stuff. It's 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 complicated, but I'm having a fun time doing that, and soon it'll be a thing. Ooh. Are those both ones you made for me? Is that like two different versions? Is that what I'm seeing? Y'all, these are so cute. I really want to show these off. You have way more. Oh, I see. You're just showing me ones that you've done in the past. These are really adorable. I love them. I have full confidence that if you did one for me, it would be amazing. I would totally use it too. I keep looking for a string. There's never going to be any. Unless I kill some spiders. No, wait, that wasn't the only thing. I also need food. All right, let me punch up some of this wheat. You know, with how popular the sort of, like, class skill systems are in, like, modded servers and stuff, I think, I think it might be cool if that kind of made it into vanilla Minecraft. That way, it wouldn't be, like, every cool thing that you can do with gaining skills isn't all loaded into the enchanting table system. You just finished one that you made for me? You must have a lot of stuff to work with. Oh, Axolotl, yours looks great too. That's amazing. It is really cute. You did a great job. It's even got a recognizable Axolotl on the on the hoodie, it looks like, or sweater. That's so cute. Oh, you even gave me a rainbow! No way! That's awesome! <laughs> I love that. This one's for me to use, is that right? I'm certainly downloading it, that's for sure. This is so cute. Y'all are great at making skins. I haven't touched that in a long time. And y'all are just like knocking it out of the park. That's so cool. <laughs> oh, you can hear me. <laughs> I don't know why I typed you. I thought I thought I saw it after I had said it. But I was probably wrong. <laughs> I got a little bit of scramble brain. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Y'all are great. Your Minecraft shut down. Ah, that's where you went. I gotta ask Mystic. I gotta ask two things. One, can I use this skin on my Minecraft account? And two, can I show it off in the fan art section with any like name or social link that you want? Heck yeah. Give me give me a thing to credit you by. And it can be a name or a link or both. Do you want it just Mystic? And not like uh, maybe your Twitter handle or your Twitch stream? That one's really cute. I love the moon design. I love that it's so clearly pajamas. I would have not figured out how to do that. How to make it be like, yo, this guy is definitely wearing pajamas. That's so cute. But where are the spiders? Mere spiders. Little creepy crawlies. Get over here with your eight legs. I need your string. Give me your butt string from your butt. There's like no mobs. There's not a single mob. It's Minecraft Midnight as well. Weird. <laughs> <laughs> you turned into an actual serial killer there. <laughs> yeah, I like to do voices. I've been working on my, like, deep notes. Because I was talking to, like, um a trans lady I know about, like, vocal training and stuff. And it made me realize that I don't really practice my deep voice a lot. I just sing. That's a really good way to do it. The choir warm ups, where you go up and down the scales and stuff, those help so much. In fact, they help so much that you really don't need to do any specialized trans voice training. Although those things can be helpful for some people, I think that it's better to do it the free way. When I'm not in the mood to sing, I like to just like, um, I like read something out loud monotone and then like every so often I like go down a half step. I call it step reading and it's really good for safely stretching your voice. There's a mob. Die. It took me like, you know, training pitch is one thing, but understanding head voice versus chest voice is so like weird to me like it takes a lot of concentration and and and, and practice songs to feel your arsonist says he oh pardon me <laughs> it's a fiery playlist to feel your arsonist tendencies that's amazing you weren't kidding about the arson thing you're just like super into arson that's very beautiful I just happened to show you something that lights stuff on fire. And you're just like, oh! I bet you're super excited, huh? You're like, arson. Finally, somebody gets me.
<laughs> yes, indeed. <laughs> All right, what are we doing next? I'm following your lead. <laughs> Let my Minecraft uncrash itself. Oh, is that still happening? Dang. I hope it goes well. Got some sunflowers over there. Got some cows over there. Is that a Minecraft village or is that somebody built that? I forgot. You got acrobatics for Pong. That's so great. Well, while you're waiting for it to uncrash, you could always let me know verbally or, I mean, through text. Just like what the plan might be. If you had any ideas for it. It seems like you're making up the design as you go, which is like very impressive. For what you have there, it's like nice, nice, nice. Oh, I see. This is somebody else's build. Do, 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 do. Of course, that makes sense. <laughs> arson, 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 arson. <laughs> So, what are you in for? Uh, nothing. <laughs> no shoplifting. <laughs> but it says arson on your shirt. It says, there's nothing better than, and then it says arson. No, no, it's definitely shoplifting. Are those potatoes? No. I planted this whole field just a minute ago. That's weird. Kind of looks like potatoes. Oh, you weren't just saying arson. That was your response to my question about what we do next. <laughs> hey, you made it back on. Hello. I'm ready, willing, and able to bring my skills to the table. And I'm going to keep a bone in my offhand just because I'm a dog and I like bones. <laughs> Sorry, I was moving without moving. That's okay. <laughs> Move without moving. Flex without flexing. Oh, for a little dip. Unfinished canopy removal. Want some top tier meat? <laughs> Is it rotten flesh? I'll take it no matter what. Sure. What you got? <laughs> oh yeah, that's top tier for sure. Thanks. I'm delighted. <laughs> I 
I knew you would do that. How did I know you would do that? I knew it. Well, I wanted to clear up this canopy for you. <laughs> arson. <laughs> you just say arson and run away. I love that. It's like you're a Pokemon. Arson, arson, arson. Arson, ar, arson, arson, arson. <laughs> exactly. Might be all of them. I don't see anything else. That should be fine then. I can't believe someone so fun, charismatic, and popular decided to follow my humble Twitch stream. I'm blessed. I'm truly blessed. I'm very excited. I'm like kind of close to finishing the first like, you know, little gauntlet they make you do. I gotta go, but in a I gotta go in a bit. Oh that's totally fine. I'm only doing another half hour anyway. That means no more arson. Aww. I'm like almost to affiliate, I think. <laughs> Hi. Oh, a hug. Hug. <laughs> Aw, it was great meeting you. And your server is rad. That's really cool. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure we'll see each other again. You know where to find me, I know where to find you. Should be great. <laughs> and doing more collabs is going to be good too. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> all right i'm gonna drop all my stuff off before i end up leaving the server because i can't use it if i'm not here and you can there you go <laughs> arson, ar, arson, ars, ars, arson. <laughs> That's so beautiful. Pika pee Pikachu. Oh dang! I don't even see this. I feel like if I had a Pokemon type thing like that, it would just be dog. It'd just be the word dog. It'd just be me going like dog, 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 Ar arson, ours, ours, arson. <laughs> hey, life's a beach.
Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Phone. Oh wait, if you can like actually toss a bone in Minecraft, shouldn't like if you have a dog, shouldn't it like go fetch? That should totally be a thing. T like fetch should totally be a thing in Minecraft. You can barely do anything else with dogs anyway. Arf. I fetched the bone. Arf. Here. <laughs> I returned it. Ah. Arf. <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> Uh, where, where, where's it gonna be? Where's it gonna go? Did you throw it? Did you throw it? Uh, there it is. Boing. <laughs> Here you go. Ugh. <laughs> <sighs> <sighs> I'll keep yawning. I'm going to take an actual nap after this. <laughs> axolotl says axolotl noises. <laughs> I think that might be like blub blub. I think it might be like blub 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 blub. Like blub 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 blub. Ha ha. Now I have the bone. Now you can't take it from me. Ha 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 ha. Ha I have the bone now. Ha ha ha. <laughs> that is so sweet. People keep saying that no matter what I do. I feel like if I sneeze or like have like a coughing fit, people will still call it cute. Well, I appreciate it. I love being cute. It's fun. It's not even on purpose. It just happens. Ooh. That was a yawn too. I don't know if it was cute, but it, it was a yawn. Oh, I missed something. Uh, arf, cough, cough, arson, cough, cough, arf. <laughs> arf, arf, arson, arf, arf. <laughs> It's like, did your dog just say arson? No. He said arf. He's a dog. It's like, no, no, I'm pretty sure you just said arson. Dog's like, arson! Arf! <laughs> Big brother is cute. Yeehaw. If that's me, then I accept the compliment. If it's not me, then cruel. Oh, hello. <gasps> <sighs> I'm yawning. I keep yawning. Your IRL brother abandoned you? That's gotta suck. I'm sorry. It doesn't feel great to be neglected, not for sure. If my avatar is doing something weird, it's because I'm rubbing my eye. I have no idea what it looks like because I'm not looking at it. Yeah. Arson! 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 <laughs> Acrobatics. Awoo! <laughs> Look, there's a moon. Awoo! Arf, arf. <laughs> oh yeah, I went full furry this stream. People are gonna use this in a cringe compilation, I just know it. 
You know, that's fine, because I'm having a better time than they are. <laughs> Arf! <laughs> Keep yawning. Hey, bro? Yeah, what's up? Yes, sibling? Exo says, I found two very cute videos of Axel Auto Sounds. Oh, you gotta post that in the sharing channel because I need to see that. Shugs? Is that like shrugs or like shucks? What's up? Hugs? Aww, hugs you too. For sure, for sure. 100 million hugs. You've been like really fun to play with. I hope we do this again. And definitely voice chat next time. I just gotta get a sense of people's like sense of humor and stuff and what kind of thing they'll type of try to say on the chat. <laughs> we can do a let's play thing. Yeah, let's do it. That sounds great. <laughs> Acrobatics. <laughs> I got to level 30. Parkour. Or cool, or cool. That guy's got enchanted armor. That's illegal. Let's bust him. Yeah. <laughs> That'll teach him. <laughs> I was really just hoping to loot him, but he didn't drop. Axel, you did post them? Awesome. I'm definitely going to watch them after the thing. Check chat. Uh, oh, yeah. No, I saw you said that you were on level, like, like 1,700. That's awesome. <laughs> this must be your favorite server, huh? That makes sense. Mm -hmm. What, you joined two days ago? What have you been doing? <laughs> how are you power leveling like that <laughs> arson <laughs> you know what that I, you know I should have seen that coming Axo says how do you feel about games about shooting and knife throwing and stabbing with no gory stuff on Roblox listen if you want me to play more Roblox I'll play more Roblox all you gotta do is like make an indication in the in the stream suggestions thing. Cause so far, I think only one person actually voted in the polls and nobody said anything about Roblox yet. So if you want me to do something, you gotta give me the feedback. <laughs> and if I say yes to something on a stream, let's be real, I'm probably gonna forget. That's why the channel exists. To make sure that your requests are honored and appreciated and met. <laughs> oh goodness. Somebody in the other chat just randomly said, My favorite crime is tax evasion. <laughs> like, okay, cool. Mystic's just having a good time just saying arson a lot, and I love that about them. Poof poof, arson poof. Is that you're just brandishing two puffer fishes and saying poof poof arson? That's 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 amazing. Absolutely. <laughs> Axo says, I was making sure it was a game that we are okay with before I shared it. That's the thing, right? Is that my restrictions on chat is actually way more strict than my restrictions on the games that's because the games are predictable and they have warnings and like you know most people have heard of them before and know what to expect that kind of thing games nowadays all come with their own content warnings so it's great poof i know i love it when the when the puffer fish poof up i used to have a pool of puffer fish just in my town but then like the villagers kept <laughs> jumping into the puddle and dying <laughs> and then the iron golems would pick a fight with a fish you ever seen an iron golem pick a fight with a 
fish. It's so funny. <laughs> Ooh, my head hurts. Yeah, those are poison. <laughs> are you okay? Get a headache from the poison puffer fish. <laughs> you might want to drink some milk or something. <laughs> oh man, you look so sad. <laughs> oh my goodness. This poor fool is ill. Aw, oh, there, there. I'm so sorry. I hope you feel better. Let me know if you need anything. <laughs> Aw, do you need a bucket? <laughs> you can yarf in it. <laughs> hugs? Yeah! Absolutely. Here's hugs. Hug! <laughs> I hope you feel better. <laughs> <laughs> yeah oh oh i i figured out another way to, to, to put the the content or anything so like what i do to a video game character and what a video game character does to me and what a video game character does to another video game character is not interpersonal interaction people talking to each other in chat is interpersonal interaction and that's the part that I want to keep nice and wholesome. Because how we treat each other matters a lot to me. If it's fake, I don't care as much. Wait, what did you eat this time? It looked like you ate a sapling. <laughs> I cannot recommend that, but I'm impressed. Oh, a spider eye. <laughs> I like that you're just like, you know what? Making potions and flasks is overrated. Just make them in your stomach. Let's see. My cousin gave me a hug, says Axolotl. And then I punched him in the gut before he kicked me in the forbidden ink sack. Why? Why did either of you do any of that? <laughs> I mean, I've known people who are violent with their family members, but I do not understand it. I mean, okay. I was also like that, but like, you know, when I was real little, like real little. It's tiring. Even if you enjoy fighting people physically, it's so exhausting. Like constantly being having to be on your guard, all this stuff. Yeah, I'm watching. It's just how we communicate. That sucks, honestly. <laughs> Arsene! <laughs> That's so beautiful. Axel, are you seeing this absolutely charming person? This mystic just becoming like a block fountain while shouting the word arson. What, what does this mean? I don't know. Am I loving it? Yes. <laughs> Pardon me. I didn't realize that would happen. Whee! Mystical. Yeah! Hey, Mystic Mayhem, you're mystical. <laughs> Axolotl says gorgeous. Mm -hmm, that's true. So elegant. <laughs> Mystic Mayhem says arson, smiley face. I think that means thank you in arson language. <laughs> you had an acrobatics related death. I also did. Acrobatics is just fun. I 
I'm just now realizing I have no idea how to get to that build. I've, I've just been teleporting to you. I gotta go. My arson is coming to an end. You know, that's sad, but I understand. Everything must end eventually. Sometimes it's arson. Such is life. Axolotl says, we used to play cops and robbers. You are the robber, you're given a fake knife. If you're the cop, you're given a fake gun. Oh. <laughs> Mystic Mayhem says, I'm gonna go oof myself. Mystic, I hope you have a great day. It was super nice playing with you. <laughs> Bye, sibling. <laughs> Axolotl says, Now the robber has to get to the waypoint or kill the cop and the cop had to get the robber on his stomach or shoot him. So y'all just straight up played cops and robbers. I, I I didn't even think that was a thing people were interested in doing. Like I knew that they, it existed, but I didn't know anybody who actually did it. Like the whole cops and robbers, cowboys and Indians is just like it's like, let's reenact harmful power dynamics for fun. I don't really get that. I want to play these videos of the axolotl sounds. I'm gonna go back to the menu and then play these sounds. Hold on, I gotta do this. Gary the ice level. Okay. Multiple times a day. I go gulp some air at the surface. Even if mommy is not watching me. She can tell I'm doing it. I do. Be ready. Okay, I think I'm ready. <laughs> it's like a little. <laughs> what the heck? Yo, these are cute. Axo says, and then when I shoot him, I mean, like in a fake vital organ, not like a leg or an arm, like the middle of your chest, and also the fake gun. It's a gel gun, so you put gel balls in it, and it does not hurt. I don't know what a gel gun is, but if that's like a sort of like a softer version of an airsoft rifle, like, I can understand that. Like a, like a Nerf gun type of thing. That's cool. Look at these little fish lizard babies. They think they're so cute. I got news for them. They are cute. Breaking point on Roblox. Nice, 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 nice. I do have some time left, but only like 10 minutes. Well, I can certainly check it out for 10 minutes. That's not a bad idea. We can switch the stream over really quick for Minecraft to something else. We're at a natural stopping point with Minecraft anyway. Hmm, yeah, let's do that. Let's see, let me grab up Roblox, and I will make sure to change everything over this time and not forget. <laughs> Did you watch the other videos? So cute. Yeah, I watched both of them. I couldn't hear it very well, but I love them. I'm very happy about it. What's it called again? Breaking Point.
Remember, everybody watching and everybody here, if you want me to play something specific or don't want me to play something specific or want more of something or anything else, you need to try out a game, you want me to replay something I've done before, let me know. Feedback is the only way I will know. So make sure to get in the Discord and to put your preferences and ideas into the poll and into comments. Axo says, and the fake knife is made of a slightly harder type of foam, just the right amount to feel it. So a good sort of like nerf battle knife. I totally get you. Those are good. I used to play uh, Humans vs. Zombies, which was so fun. It was so good. It was like the humans all had like um, like long range nerf weapons and the zombies all had like melee nerf weapons. And uh, yo, it was super fun. There was like a hundred people playing at the same point it was at some point. It was just super amazing. All right, time to switch the capture over. Uh, there it is. And changing from Minecraft to Roblox. And I'm gonna change the stream title to Pow Pow Gun Dog. I've decided that when I am in a general situation, I'm Dog Boy. But when I'm playing with guns, it's gun dog. <laughs> it means nothing, but it's what I've chosen. By the way, it was not just me and him. It was like all of our cousins who wanted to play. This game takes skill. I don't know which specific game, but cool. I'm not paying much attention to this actual game yet. The shooter has three seconds to kill. Is this Mafia? Are we playing Mafia? I get it. It's Mafia, Witch Hunt, Werewolf, Paranoia. It's those games. Uh, Among Us is actually basically the same game as well. As well as um, Salem Town, I think it was called. You just wasted your round. Yeah, I wasn't paying attention whatsoever. I think I got killed right off the right off the bat. And there is more than this game. There's a lot more than this mode. Understand. Understandable. Oh, I see. Here's a leaderboard. <laughs> duck, duck, stab. Everyone picks their own opponent. The player that survives goes back to their seat. Interesting. Minecraft is still actually open in the background. Okay, okay, that makes more sense. Oh good, there's somebody named Bingus. That's what I would have done. 
This seems like the kind of game where it would take a bit of getting used to and like learning what all the of different things are. I'm still surprised at how involved Roblox games get. It's like, who are these development teams working on these games? Because it can't just be kids. I've seen what, like, um, like um, utilities that uh, kids like to make a lot of content for. Even when they put a lot of effort into it, it's not like this. Well, most of the people are dead in that game. Unfortunately, while this might be fun to play, um, like, on your own time, I feel like any game like this, where most of the time you're standing around waiting for other people to be dying, is like, you know, not super great for a stream. Because then you'll be bored and I'll be bored. It's not letting you get into the game? Yeah, probably server pool. The two players with the most votes will fight. I don't even know what the knife button is. Oh, I managed to kill her, though. How nice. Mm. Axo says, no, it's every time I try to get in your game, it closes the application? Or says the same account on different devices? Oh, well, make sure you're not logged in in other places. It could be that, <laughs> that you have two versions of the client open accidentally or something. I don't know. Oh, wait, is that you? Hey, that's you right there. I see you. So you're logged in somewhere. Oh, not anymore, apparently. Who did it? The murderer will kill and the lights off. Everyone can vote to kill whoever they believe did it. I see. It loads in and it kicks me out. That's my account. I'm sorry you're having trouble. I'm not sure what to do about it. 
I could always just like reload mine, see if I get into a server that helps somehow. I don't know. Could you try joining me? Because it works when I'm not joining you or your editing machine. Okay. Uh, I mean, let's see. I think we have time. Oh, never mind. I think that was the 10 minutes. <laughs> yeah, we're at two hours. But you know what? I can bring this back up next time. Because this seems like a game that needs a little bit of time to practice and stuff. We'll we'll iron out all the all the all the issues next time for sure. <laughs> All right, see you, Dad. Bye. And I'm sorry I haven't put up the fan art yet. I'm working on it, and today I got a lot done, and I'm really excited about it, and I hope it'll be cool when you do see it. I think it will be. <laughs> All right, bye. Have a good day. Everyone who's watching, thanks for